Hi, Gemini. Welcome to your mid-month reading for April 2021. Today we are starting to have a look at your um, chakras to see what chakra is in need of more balance for the rest of the month. Okay, and then we're going to have a look at the oracle and see um, how can you um, work around this. Okay, and then we're going to jump into the tarot. But for now, let's have a look and see what chakra it's in need of special attention for Gemini. Heart chakra. Okay. Gemini, heart chakra here. There's a need for more connection with yourself. Okay, so for those of you who are not aware of the chakras, so we have seven main chakras in our spine, which are wheels of energy. Okay, so they go around different parts of our life, different parts of our body, mind, and soul. Okay, so in the heart chakra, it's more concerned about your self love, about the connection with your inner child, about some feelings of abandonment, lack of love, okay, lack of emotions, lack of, um, it, it's normally a lot of lack of love, okay, lack of sensations, lack of connecting with yourself, so it's like the need to connect with yourself, the need to connect with your inner child, the need to connect with your inner guide, okay, um, well, let's have a look here into, and normally, of course, this heart chakra is, um, identified as the color green okay it can also be connected with the color pink so if this is something that you would like to be looking into maybe look into more um green foods green color okay the emerald crystal if you like crystals and stones okay maybe light a green candle or a pink candle um, okay be more into nature, okay? Connect with the greens, connect with the roots, okay? Um, and let's see. How can we advise Gemini to balance the heart chakra? <clears throat> We have desires, which comes from the sacral chakra. Okay. We have guidance. Okay. Listen, as I mentioned before. And we have one more, the mind. Okay. And the mind, third eye chakra. So your heart chakra it's the base of everything, okay? This is the central, this, the central chakra. It's right in your heart. So we all live from the heart, okay? When you see we live from the heart, of course, because the heart is where all our sensations, our emotions, our compassion, our love comes, okay? And when you are aligned here, everything around feels better, tastes better, smells better, okay? Your ideas feel better. Okay, so what we have here that you could assist with that desire, it's goals, passion, craving, fulfillment, maybe there's a lack of fulfillment feelings around you and then they give you some, um, you don't pay attention to that, okay, you don't pay attention to your fears, to your desires, you don't pay attention to your cravings, because sometimes your cravings can actually advise you what is, um, what part of your body, what part of your emotions are, um, what situations around you are causing you this, maybe this lack of self-love, this lack of self-care, okay, forgetting about yourself and just trying to do everything else, okay, maybe setting up goals could definitely be something that you would look into, okay, and as well, accepting yourself the way you are. Why am I saying this? Because you see this lady here, okay? She's naked. And what is she? She's putting the hands like, come to me, okay? Because she accepts the way she is, okay? She is open 
to whatever comes. Why? Because she accepts herself the way she is. Okay, she embraces her body, she embraces her soul, she embraces her emotions. And this is definitely what it's coming here. She is fulfilled. Why? Because her body is in peace. And this is why this heart chakra comes here as well. Okay, the need to, it's like, the lack of confirmation you need someone to confirm to you yes you are beautiful yes you are amazing yes you are great or yes you you know you anything but this comes from the heart comes from you first okay once you accept yourself the way you are everything else comes okay and then we have as well this guidance here support love signs direction this comes from our crown chakra so the connection with the earth the connection with the universe in as well we have here the sun and the moon so whether it's daylight or nightlight okay there's here this um immense guidance bringing to you but for some reason because you're not listening to yourself you're not loving yourself you're not listening to this guidance okay so what the cards are telling you be more open listen to yourself feeling your emotions when you're walking around someone see how you feel observe the sensations observe the emotions okay how you speak to people how you direct yourself to someone how people approach you all of that okay learn from yourself your emotions your feelings okay because we're all energy so energy it's everywhere when you approach someone you feel the energy that your energy connects with the other person it doesn't mean it's a bad person it just means your energy don't connect or they do connect because when you meet someone for the first time and you have that feeling of wow i know this i feel i know this person for so long your energies completely connect okay maybe you you're you're like-minded people and this is why we're always saying you know try to interact with more like-minded people because the energy vibrates higher okay so let's see what are the advices from your guides for you okay we're taking three cards from the tarot for Gemini for the mid month April 2021 what are the advices as I'm shuffling the cards I just want to remind you that this is a general reading okay it doesn't mean it's going to resonate exactly with you take what resonates leave the rest for another person and if it doesn't resonate at all please don't try to force it into your current situation, okay? Maybe have a look at your other um, strong signs on your birth chart. So we have two cards for the moment. We have the chariot and the lovers. So we have the chariot here as something moving forward. Let me just take one more. Okay, the sun, beautiful. So let's just clarify this card. So the chariot lovers and the sun. There are choices here, could be choices from the heart. Why am I saying from the heart? Because in the lovers here, we have Archangel Raphael, which is the healer, okay? There's, there's a need for some healing here. I feel a lot of healing, a lot of um, need for healing for most signs for this mid-month reading okay so definitely this healing is going to make you um succeed okay connect to yourself make better choices see life from a different perspective maybe connecting to people maybe this could be even like some sort of healing online okay from a different place because especially with these lovers we have here this ten of wands it's like it's like letting go all the burdens you you do, you're not like put something out of your mind you cannot carry the world's problems okay you carry your own problems you deal with your own problems and you leave the rest 
for the other people, okay? You do what you can, all right? And it's like this healing here, once you um, connect more with your heart chakra, with your inner child, with your inner guide, there's a lot of things that are just gonna go, okay? Look here, the sun with the queen of cups, the need to connect with yourself, okay? Connect with your inner feelings, connect with your healing, okay? Uh, but let's start here from the chariot and the three of wands. There's opportunity here. There's an opportunity here for you to heal yourself. There's an opportunity here for you to interact with yourself more so you can move forward, okay? And this moving forward, it's like you need to protect yourself more from the energies around you, okay? So whoever you deal with. We have here Archangel Metatron, okay? So this Archangel Metatron, you could also be dealing with, uh, maybe with children. I don't know, of course, you could have children in your life. You could have uh, children in your family or anything like that, okay? And what he's asking here is like, protect yourself because this tree of, tree of wands as well, it's, it's the finally coming up after working so hard. So it's like you've been working so hard on something and the rewards will finally start coming here okay because you are protected look at here archangel michael you are protected okay you are definitely protected here all right and you know exactly where to go you know what to do you're just not taking action but you know what to do okay and this is what they are telling you go ahead and do what you have to do okay and then the lovers with the ten of wands powerful healing here why am i saying powerful healing here look at the sign healing look at the sign healing okay the need for healing archangel raphael here again with archangel michael so they're protecting you and healing you from whatever needs to be done okay and i mentioned before the heart chakra is the green color okay archangel raphael here green color okay the green color could be very good for you whether you have plants at home whether you have a green stone okay emerald stone or anything maybe use green more so that you connect more self with your heart chakra with your love okay go into nature eat greens okay all this and and just accept that you are enough okay you don't have to be dealing with everyone's problems okay you cannot carry everyone's ones you can carry your own and that's good enough because when you heal yourself you're healing the universe and that is just so much more than nothing okay remember you are enough you are what you are okay and then we have the sun and the queen of cups so why not take care of yourself look at this take care of yourself it's the best option at the moment. Take care of yourself, okay? There are some brilliant ideas coming into your head. There are some good guidance, okay? Your third eye is sending you messages. Your crown chakra, it's guiding you. It's showing you that love is the way, okay? Uriel here, it's bringing you the knowledge that those brilliant ideas are coming to you. You just have to listen to them, okay? Because everything will be just fine. Take care of yourself. This is what you need. Because once you take care of yourself, this is how your life turns into, okay? It turns into this beautiful sun. Everything around shines. Everything is balanced, okay? Everything in the perfect timing. And look at the queen here. The queen is the person that only cares only focus on taking care of other people why not taking care of yourself look at her here sitting she is looking at the sea she's looking forward okay she's looking forward she has her feet in the water like it's time to start my healing okay she's feeling the water okay feeling her own emotions so it's time for you to start feeling your own emotions okay and and just accept how you feel everything will be fine all right just work on your own healing this is very strong i cannot stress enough how much 
self-healing you they are asking you here for you to have okay all right they're very jumpy today so we have four cards for you today so we have telepathy non-verbal communication mind reading okay here we go again okay living from the heart look at the mermaids they are here come from the heart and you have the mind as well so listen to your heart okay the heart speaks from for your mind okay. experiments manipulation of nature forcing change cruelty in the pursuit of knowledge arrogance are you going against yourself? You know, this is what it feels like. You're going against your heart. You're going against your nature. Okay. The return of Aphrodite's temple, birth of the goddess, guidance, goddess energy, treating as sacred. Treat yourself as sacred, okay? You are special. Just as you came here, this body with the desires card, okay? You are special here. All right, everyone is, and you are not less than others. And with these dolphins here, what I can tell you is have some fun. Don't see things as serious as they seem, okay? And the last one, we have energy field adjustment or cleaning and health. Again, health here, okay? A lot of healing for you. And this is self-healing, okay? It's not about all this quick healings okay quick fix no this is something from the heart from yourself from your chakras from emotions okay the need to look into your emotions are you aware of your emotions at all gemini this could be something that you could look into as well you know write down your emotions whenever you're having some sort of emotions ask yourself why am i feeling like this what is triggering this okay maybe work into that you could even go and look into some um professional uh, whether is a, a a practitioner a holistic coach okay a mentor anything like that that could help you with this okay definitely will be a good idea to do that all right gemini this is what i have for you sending you lots of love and light and until next time have a great month bye bye